home, friends. Your presence here means you have chosen well. An evening ripe with food and friends, and we have a tale to tell. A tale of a church and the trials they face when trying to balance the budget. The, chur <laughs> the church lacks a focus. They can't find their place. Lesser men would try to fudge it. But our struggling friends will gather again and argue and bicker and quip. But all that they're missing is a possible mission. In short, they need stewardship. So, what to expect? What do we hope to share with our little ballad? No murder tonight, some mayhem, no fright. There's got to be marshmallow salad. Glad you came with your very many hors d'oeuvres for your table. You're kind of chintzy. Anytime, now, anytime, they can be gone. It is gone wide in the world that they would have a painting at this time of year. This is college days, scholarships. I just don't know what's happening. Eight hours of apartment meetings, college graduates, scholarships. Oh, if that preacher ever calls me for another meeting at this time of year, no. Friend, food may not be everything, 
is a big piece of the crossword puzzle. I think we ought to think twice about putting on a muzzle on the making and sharing of food. You know I, what I mean? I know what I want to put a muzzle on. <laughs> oh dear. Now, going right on, as I was saying, I could have devised a budgetary suggestion that I'd like to call the toilet paper budget. This here budget's kind of a, a two-ply plan. <laughs> It's an ink blot test. It's an ink blot. My budget is something of a two-ply plan. First, I have undertaken an exhausting and an extensive survey, and I have come to the conclusion that our restroom facilities are an unnecessary expense. I need it. Fly one of my two fly plan as we will close the restrooms. Lock them up tight. Why, what we'll save on soap, 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 soft soap alone is astronomical. You say that. <laughs> well, well, then comes part two of my two fly plan. Try that one too. Just two years ago, I bought this case toilet paper at our local Dollar General. Since then, we've only used one carton out of it. Now that just supports my theory that our restroom facilities are an unnecessary expense. So, apply B to my two-ply plan. We're going to use this toilet paper for all of our printing needs. Oh. <laughs> Newsletters, bulletins. We'll print fewer and we'll all share. Now, this here budget is a numero uno example of how this toilet paper can be used creatively. Well, this is disgusting. The ink is all running and it's smudged and you cannot read a thing on these pages. Now, never you mind this. We got to cut the budget and this here toilet paper budget is the way to go. Uh. No, 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 impossible. I cannot support a closing of the restrooms and the toilet paper bulletins and newsletters. No. Well, Sugar Pie, are you feeling all right? I've just never seen you be quite so aggressive. No, I'm not feeling all right. If you remember correctly, I suffered a near fatal accident last year, a near-death experience. Just from faulty electrical wire. So, I'm very adamant about not cutting necessary services. And I'd like to share my budget proposal, if that's okay. Well, get on with it. Okay, I have it right here somewhere. 